This is the moment our producer became trapped in the middle of a gun battle. Pro and anti-government protesters faced off at a major intersection in Laxey, a suburb of Bangkok. Filming on a handy cam, she sees anti-government protesters shooting at a rival group. We can't confirm if government supporters shot back. I think they shot him, this woman says. Be careful, he might shoot again. The gunmen can be seen hiding their weapons under plastic bags and towels. The rest of our team had just left the area. We're hearing uh, gunshots uh, down this road. Uh, that's where the pro-government, pro-election supporters uh, are. They're all actually crouched down underneath this flyover. On this side are uh, the anti-government, uh, uh, anti-election group. They've created a, a first line of defence, if you like. And, and just down the road, on the other side of this road, is where all the anti-government, anti-election people have camped out outside a government building trying to stop ballot boxes leaving for polling stations. Anti-government protesters had set up camp overnight. We'd been filming there during the day when a few hours later, government supporters who want the election to go ahead marched through Laxey. Police managed to stop them en route and just as they began to disperse, the first shots were fired. We're hearing a lot of uh, gunshots in quick succession. They're coming from one of these buildings. You can't quite make out where from, but you can actually smell the smoke in the air right now. Thailand's national security chief has told CNN he's deploying extra security personnel to the polling station where Prime Minister Ying Luck will be voting. 10,000 security personnel are on standby as Bangkok braces itself for election day. Simon Morse in CNN, Bangkok, Thailand.